y'all, it's Face by Trace here, and I'm coming to you all with a new video. And this video is a very special video, late video, but special video. Um, it's about some lashes that I launched on August 15th. Um, literally, that date was like on my heart, and I don't know why. Um, not to say that date isn't special, um, as many of you guys probably know at this point I lost my brother in 2006 and his birthday is actually August 15th um, another special event that happened on August 15th was my girl Bianca um, her and her husband got married on so August 15th anniversary as well so there was a few things that happened on that date and that date just kept sticking out to me um, literally woke me up from my sleep so I decided to launch on August 15th, 2020. Um, so this video is just to pretty much um, give you a little bit of background as to um, why I started doing this um, and what does each lash mean. So the reason why I started to do lashes was because I found myself falling in love with lashes. Um, before, um, in my makeup career, I guess you can say, I hated lashes. Like, I didn't mind putting them on my clients, but I just hated lashes. I would do my looks and keep it pushing, just add some mascara um, and just keep it pushing. But so here, I was just talking about a whole bunch of blah, blah, blah. But for the most part, you guys know that I am a freelance makeup artist located here in Boston, Massachusetts. Um, but one of the other main reasons that I forgot to mention um, about starting my own lash business was that I was tired of using everyone else's lashes, giving them promotion, and not, for one, not getting any recognition for that, and for two like spending so much money on buying lashes and not even in bulk like it was so hard um so I was like you know what I'm just gonna start doing the footwork doing my own research and doing my own thing and being able to um gain more clientele from this and offering my clients something that you know I did so much research on and testing on and things of that nature um, so we can become like a squad or something. I don't know. But right. yeah, I forgot to mention that. So Do my it. mission statement is makeup for the everyday woman by unknown. I really don't know who came up with that and I'm not trying to take credit for someone else's words. Makeup for the everyday woman is a statement within itself and doesn't need much explanation. However, the purpose is to uplift and celebrate women, specifically women that look like me, to show how different we are all while being dope in our own right. This is the first collection of many. Season one, are you ready? So um, I also want to clarify this too because I didn't want people to feel some type of way. Now, pretty much all of my friends, like my good, good, good friends are females. And what stand strongly behind my brand is strong females, whether you're a mother, an auntie, a godmother, whatever. It's a team of women behind me, period. Um, and so I decided to name each lash by an inspirational woman in my life. So to emphasize season one, there's different seasons in TV shows. There's different seasons in life. So I plan on having more seasons in my lash collection. And each season is going to have approximately five different styles, completely different styles, named by five different women. Um, and the reason why I did this is because they impacted me um, in a way. I consider them all sisters, regardless if we talk every day or not. Um, they impacted me in a way, and they've always had my back no matter what. When I always felt like I had nobody, I knew that I can call anyone that I call my friend. Um, it's like a method to the madness. Like, 
everything has to flow naturally I didn't want it to be forced I did I don't want anyone to kind of like persuade my thinking I want it to come naturally because this is what represents me this is me um, so I wanted it a certain way but I said you know what it's in God's time and I can't always have things my way so I just let it flow I did not show any of my girls the first five the first batch I did not show any of them I did not show any of them how the lashes look, what style was being chosen, or anything like that. I literally chose the people. I didn't even chose the people. Like, it just flowed naturally. I looked at the lashes, and it just, it just flowed naturally. So, um, I, once I did everything, got my custom boxes and everything, I then sent them a video like, hey, blah, 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 blah. And they had no idea. I didn't tell anybody my plans because I wanted it to feel right. I wanted it to be set in stone and this is what it's supposed to be and how it's supposed to go. Okay? So, just to kind of clear that up, I don't want anyone to feel some type of way. You may be season two, you may be season three. But, again, I want to emphasize friends because, yeah. Anywho, so let's get into these last So... My lashes range from 16 mm to 25 mm. I have five different styles: 216, 220, and 125. Okay, so this is my box. Can you? Okay, there you go. And my girl Tokyo actually um, designed this for me. Um, I will keep her information down below too if you would like a custom logo, okay? And the reason why I chose a simple black box is because my logo is kind of busy, like especially around the eyes and then the FBT, Face by Trace, um, is like bright colors. Like I have the kind of like light purple, the yellow, the pink, and then makeup artist and teal. So I didn't want it to be too busy. My packaging is the same thing. It's black and simple, um, and it's like an explosion of color in the inside, you know? Um, so, yeah. So the first style that we have is called Meet Me. So... So, Mimi, I knew since middle school. We went way back, like Cadillac on flats. Um, and Mimi's always been the type, like, she take, she's always have taken her education very seriously. Whatever she has set out to do, she's going to do by any means necessary. Whether it be traveling, buying a house, whatever. Whatever she sets her mind to, she's going to do. She's always been about her money. She's always been about family with her close friends like she and she's so compassionate about what she does so that's what i really 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 love about that girl like she's so passionate um she says how she feels she means what she says and she's just overall just a dope friend. the next style we have is also 16 mm and the style is called little bit bit Okay, so a little bit bit. I cannot give you guys her government, but um, that's my homegirl. We went way back as well. Well, not way, way back, but um, we did a program together called Europe Boston. And um, she was like this little feisty fireball, like a <laughs> little feisty fireball. But she had such an old soul. Like, I was so... I didn't believe when she told me how old she was at the time. Um, because she... you were, I really thought, like, we were, like, the same age. Um, she had such an old soul. She used to wear, like, a suit. Like, a skirt suit. With, like, these nine-inch pumps. And during that time, she wasn't driving. She was taking public transportation. And I'm like, sis, you're really taking the bus and the train with some nine inch heels like yo if I can survive <laughs> five minutes but she we it was like a almost like an eight hour program like we were in program all day almost like a job and she was in those heels all day 
I love that girl, but she is very goal oriented. Like she loves family. She loves love. She loves her children. She's a great mother, great partner. That's my sissy for life. And um, just overall a go getter, boss chick, boss mentality. You know what I'm saying? Like her heart is pure. However, <laughs> she may be little, but she's one to reckon with. She doesn't bite her tongue for nobody. Um, and she, she can be a powerhouse, but other than that, she's good peoples for sure. And yep, that was little bit bit. Next, we have besties. And besties are 20 mm, and they're these lashes are actually named like besties are. It's re regarding two people, so Jojo and Sha, aka Joanna and Ashara. Um, those are my sisters, but they are best friends. Um, literally two peas in a pod, two completely different women, but they're. They just mesh so well, like they complement each other so well, it's kind of creepy um, sometimes. But yeah, they're just overall hardworking women, great mothers, just dope women. Like I'm telling you dope women from style just to have your back, um, inspirational, like they're just hardworking, hard, hardworking, very family oriented and just dope women. I went to high school with both of them actually. Um, I, I met Jojo first and then um, I met Ashara after at the same school but um, me, I, met, I knew Jojo before I met Ashara but um, it was funny because like we did talk in high school but we got closer after high school. Thank you. So the next style that I have is called Nikki J and it is also 20mm. So Nikki J is named after my best friend Nicole and um, I met her I met her in like 20 no 2009 maybe 2008 between 2008 and 2009 we started working together and um, she was just so welcoming um, and then later on like you know at my time at the job I actually found out that I went to school with her sister hi Gigi um, and it just kind of grew from there um, she is very goal oriented, very, very, very talented, such a dope person. Um, she was in the dance, well, she's part of the dance ministry. Um, she also works with the youth at our church. Um, and yeah, she's such a great mother, great wife, great friend, great sister, great auntie. Like, she's just overall dope, super talented. She can slay a wig, honey, but like, she be playing games. So, I mean, hit her up. <clears throat> I may leave her information down below, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, last but definitely not least is Neva E. And Neva E is actually 25 mm. That is the longest length that we offer. Um, Neva, I met some years ago at a mass camp. For those who don't know what mass camps are, is where we put together carnival outfits, like the costumes and the beads and the jewels and the backpacks, the wings and all that. Um, yeah, she was very cool very like kind of to herself very like when she's working she's working very chill no drama no nothing um and we started building a bond there and it kind of grew um congratulations to you mama she just had a baby and the love that she has for her family is phenomenal like she ride like when i say ride or die like ride or die for her family like yo what's up like pull up like <laughs> like i love her so much but um She's just dope, hardworking, great person, great personality. She doesn't take nothing from nobody. Period. Period. That's it. She doesn't take nothing from nobody. But um, overall, dope person. And the one thing I can say, like, 
all the again all the women in my life have something to offer and it's not necessarily like um monetary or like gifts or anything like that like even words of encouragement even if they don't say anything just by me watching them inspires me to be better to do better because if they can do it I can do it um but yeah I have some really dope friends and yeah it's like not really much to say after that so but it's um, up and running um, I do ship international as well so if you are interested in buying a pair of lashes or five <laughs> do not hesitate to head to my website it's www.facebytracemua.com at the top it's gonna have like different like not links but like the top is gonna say shop you click on that and it's gonna show you all the styles that I have available and you can reach me through text email um, you can actually um, e like send me a message on my website as well um, through my social media handle so it's face by trace MUA on IG on Facebook um, I'm face no, I'm Trace Face MUA on Snapchat. And yeah, I think that's it. If I forgot anything, I'll put everything down in the info bar. And I think that's it. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will be seeing y'all later. Thanks for watching. Bye.